Good morning, guys. It is Tuesday. Welcome to Tuesday's vlog. All right, guys. So last night after dinner, I woke up or had like two lows. I knew I was because I bullet stacked and I predicted it. So yeah, and I'm running out of tablets. I gotta buy more glucose tablets. Got breakfast cooked up. Been eating while it's cooking. I'm hungry. Blood sugar before this was 97, but when I woke up at 7 a.m. it was 159. Took two units for the 159, and then I took these. I took three units for this breakfast. Turkey bacon, I already ate one piece. Two Frank hot dogs, egg whites, four eggs, and sugar snap peas, celery, artichoke pesto, artichokes, vitamin D, term egg, multivitamin water, hot sauce. Yes! See you soon. Leg day. After breakfast, blood sugar was 111. Checked again an hour later, 112, which is right now. And today's legs instead of tomorrow because tomorrow is my endocrinologist appointment and I want to make sure that I'm there on time and I'm not late for work because I'm working four to nine Wednesday. And uh, I'm kind of nervous. I don't know if he's going to give me the prescriptions of Levomir and uh, you no know, uh, regular insulin. We'll see how it goes. Regardless, I got to keep my head up and don't stress and don't binge, okay? Eat good food. I feel good right now. Uh, it was a big meal I had. It was like about 800 calories. Uh, the turkey franks are pretty big on calories. Each hot dog is 120 calories. Pretty high in sodium. Like I can still taste even brushing my teeth. But it's fine because I'm going to sweat a lot right now. Um, and like it took a while to digest. But uh, blood sugar is not bad for the insulins that I'm using. Uh, so I'm at any time right now. About to hit this leg workout. And I want to tell you guys something that uh, really hit my mind. Was... It, it, it's um it's basically I used to wonder why I used to get so thirsty all the time and I still do uh, being in tune with my body so much I noticed that I'm thirsty a lot and after learning from Dr. Bernstein learning that uh, blood sugar above 89 is uh, considered higher than normal uh, it's not normal even if you're diabetic so all the you know these past two years I've been like why am I thirsty why am I thirsty I'm not in the 200 or 300 range I, I only thought that you'd be thirsty in those ranges or higher uh, but coming to realize that having a blood sugar consistently over an A1C over six or five you're gonna be thirsty at least I feel it all the time and I don't know if you guys are woken to it or feel it so I just want to say I can't wait till that day I reach or those days or the years that I reach the 80s 80s blood sugar and I don't feel thirsty all the time and I feel good don't have to pee constantly so I just want to share that food for thought let's have a good workout see you guys soon all right guys so but right after uh, warming up with some cardio like I always do with my workouts my blood sugar went to let me see went to 127 from 112 so I was like you know what let me take two units of Novolog because I know this is going to jump if I don't take anything. Um, so I took two units in the stomach right before I did my squats. I was like, all right, you know what? The timing will be great. I won't shoot it in my leg because it might start working right away. I might drop. I don't know. Things have been weird. I usually do that, but today I didn't. Try on the stomach, two units. And surprisingly, my blood sugar went to 157, but that's because I think Atlantis is leaving my body. I, hit, I took a shot at 7.30 a.m. It's about 2.30 right now, so I think I'm going to take a shot right now of, of Lantis, about 8 units, and then take... So, I know Dr. Bernstein talks about be careful from net carb foods, um, protein bars that say they're this and that. Quest, bar, Quest bars, I love, and I don't know if he's with it, and I don't, he's not really with the whole high fiber. I don't know how you guys feel about high fiber. It's pretty big in fiber, two bars, so let's look at it. I got double chocolate chunk. This one's about four net carbs, okay? Four net carbs. And then uh, this one's new, it's called oatmeal chocolate chip. It, it feel, the texture feels really soft. 
I think this one's like a couple cents it's more expensive and it has one more grain of carb. It is that one's five net carbs. So at Ralph's they're cheaper quest bars. Seven elevens are like three twenty nine each quest bar. Each of these were like uh two thirty or something. So total was like four seventy or something. Um so let's see how my blood sugar goes. I'm gonna take probably two units for this in the leg okay and I have work three to five we have a soccer game uh, surprisingly I don't feel hungry like I really don't that breakfast was huge I don't I'm I always overeat breakfast cuz I'm always so worried I'm gonna be hungry and, and then indulge after so I think I'm gonna just throw out those turkey hot dogs they, they're so salty and heavy and just literally I worked out at 1 p.m. I ate at 9.40, 9.30, and it still felt like I hadn't digested. But the workout went great, uh, really progressing, making sure my form was right. I want to take you guys in the gym soon. Uh, you know, when we get my friend to come film me every once in a while. So shower, don't feel like eating, which is kind of good for me because that breakfast was huge. My body, I'm actually listening to my body right now. Um, it's telling me breakfast was too big, so I'm going to have two protein bars. Probably some vegetables to get some phytochemicals. Um, and some water. See you soon. Alright guys, quick update. So, I ate those two Quest Bars on the way to work about 2.45. And uh, I checked my blood sugar before I, I got into work. Is that my mom? No. Um, it was 147 from 154 to 147. So post workout, post legs was 154 and then it went to 147. Makes sense, you know, post workout um, blood sugar should drop just a little bit, but barely. So I took my eight units of Lantis right before my Nova Log after my shower. And then I took actually only one unit of Novolog because I was worried I might drop and I took it in the leg area because uh, I was going to eat it right away and that was 10 net carbs I didn't have any vegetables just those two quest bars I had those okay and I checked my blood sugar again because after work at 5 o'clock I drove straight to Starbucks and worked on two videos. I checked my blood sugar at work or after work at five o'clock. It went to 137. Not bad, you know, especially for my regimen. I have to kind of like have to uh, be okay with those numbers right now. I can't settle. I can't go for the 80s with Novolog and Lantis. Um, it would be hard if I tried. And then after Starbucks, um, in my car, I went to CVS. As you can see, I got some glucose tablets. I only got one too because they're actually expensive. I'm gonna go to Amazon. This was 247, and this is crucial when you're doing Dr. B's plan. Um, very crucial. It's the only thing you correct with these or gel or not honey, not fruit. You guys already know that whole spiel. So I got that, and uh, I bought a drink at <laughs> Starbucks because I didn't want to go there like be a cheap guy, use their Wi-Fi, and not buy anything, even though it's kind of expensive. It's whatever. And of course, I had to get 88 cents at CVS, some mango zero carb drink. Um, so I'm gonna check my blood sugar right now, get gas, eat dinner real soon. I'll see you guys. Day's looking great and I'm feeling good. Stop number two. <laughs> so this is the pharmacy I switched to to actually get my prescription. I'm gonna pick up my pen needles. I'm tired of doing errands, but I got some time right now. I need to check my blood sugar already too. guys so after that CBS pickup I checked my blood sugar 84 felt like I was low but that's a good number just not used to it right now and I got dinner I took two units for this I had to really think about it because the whole mobile log thing is just got five eggs okay I flipped them over got some cauliflower all right and then five and a half ounces of chicken breast it's about like a 600 calorie meal and then me and my mom are gonna go shopping I actually really want to get some stuff like whey protein almond flour make those pancakes recipes for the morning 
uh, all low carb stuff and I'm about to eat this really hungry and I'll see you guys soon all right now we're at sprouts at the shop Sisters, welcome to the madness. Okay, so after sprouts, my blood sugar went to 65. I just felt hungry. I didn't feel like low or anything. I had one tablet, right back up, perfect. Four carbs, and then um, felt like my dinner was so small, and it was because you know we went shopping right after, and I felt like I didn't get enough time, even those five eggs. <laughs> um, so. We went to a lot of places. We went to Sprouts, and then we got some good stuff there. You'll see in my meals this week. And then after Sprouts, we went to North Park instead of Smart and Final. Got some veggies, eggs, cheese, and that stuff there. A little cheaper, Arabic market. And then... Oh, went to CVS. I thought I was going to get whey protein. Turns out they don't have whey but the way I want, it's like all six carbs uh, serving or seven or eight or ten. I'm looking for like the two carb one. It's okay if it has a little circulose, cir circulose in it, it's fine. <sighs> so yeah, it's fine. I don't, I'm, not, I'm probably still going to make the pancakes. I was talking about protein pancakes, almond uh, mix, what it's called, with some uh, cashew milk and good stuff. <coughs> so at CVS, I was like, I'm really hungry. I got some pistachios with almonds it's like four carbs eat that i feel pretty good now i'm still kind of hungry but here's what i gotta do see this mess right here or all this groceries now we're blessed but <laughs> i gotta organize in the fridge mom buys it i organize it i haven't shopped much i've wondered in a while so usually when she brings stuff i'm in my room editing so today i gotta actually do this um probably cook up something really small just like a snack and uh, yeah, see how it goes. Don't want to unpack this stuff. See you soon. And of course, cannot forget this at Sprouts. Ooh, ooh. you know what flavor I got? Ginger ale. I'm about to pop open one of these, drink it nice some cold water, stare at my mom while she's on the phone, get mentally prepared to put these groceries away. I think I'm going to outro this right now. Thanks so much for watching today. That concludes Tuesday's vlog. Feel great. Feels like it's been longer in the week. Please hit the like button. Subscribe. And please comment. Hit me up on Instagram. Wherever you guys want. I want to talk to you guys. See how you guys are doing. Peace.